Alright guys, what's up? I'm Reefly. You guys are watching Zombie U for the Wii U. And last part, we got the Panacea virus, or whatever it's called. And we had to get back to safe house. I mean that... When I got just destroyed by a whole bunch of zombies. So off camera, I'm like, I decided to uh, do that uh, you know, off camera, kill all the zombies. Uh, but things didn't go so well. <laughs> So I, w I went to go get all my stuff back, and uh, so I went and killed a zombie, my former self, and I went to loot him, and I picked up all my mission items, so I'm like, oh, I got all my items, so I started running around because all the zombies were trying to attack me, and then I realized I didn't have any of my items, actually, it just said I have all my mission items. So I tried to get back to my former self, but I died, so I lost all my weapons, all my health, everything. Um, and then I died again. But I, I mean, I, I don't, I don't have any weapons besides a pistol. So I won't be, and I can't go around to go find them again because it's the end of the game. So I, all I have is my bat, some pistols, and two planks. So let's see if I can survive. And, I, oh yeah, the turret is out of ammo, too, so I can't use that. It's telling me to go over here, so I'm just going to see if I can, can't just escape. Get loading screen door. Alright, so I'm not sure how well uh, this is going to go, considering I have no weapon whatsoever, nothing powerful. Actually, I do have my old shotgun, the double barrel shotgun, but that has no ammo on it. The only reason I have that is because I left it in the, the chest, so I was able to get that at least. So I do have a backup weapon, but it's not much. Okay, this guy's pretty set up. <laughs> this is the prepper. Do you read me? Over. Oh. Wait, what? What? That's the end of the game. That's the end of the game. Are you kidding? Oh. God save our that's not, not the, that's not the end of the game. That can't. That's not the end of the game. Like I even read the missions. I'm supposed to get evac at the Tower of London again. All right, so there's zombie, you guys. Uh. <laughs> 
this uh, ending I never like it just it, the ending just happened all of a sudden like it just wow that was one of the most sudden ends I've ever seen before all right so my thoughts on the game uh as far as the the atmosphere of this game is a very good uh, survival game, horror horror game. Like it's if you're looking for a game that's gonna scare you, uh, this is a pretty good game. You get a few good scares in, and it is hard at times. Um, the gameplay is it's very generic but it does work for this game um, I wish they would add a few more animations really as far as swinging your bat and stuff like that but uh, it's not that extremely bad the controls do need some work though the story needs to get better like I, I didn't really feel attached to any of my survivors um, I mean, I get the story you're trying to survive, really, but also get out of there. So I'm not really sure. Um, I I do want a sequel though. I I hope they make another game, <clears throat> but if they do. I'd like them to improve just the the controls and overall, like actually add a jump button, a jump button and stuff like that, and not just like oh you can do this now if you press X. Uh, make the controls just smoother overall. Give up uh, more weapons, more upgrades. Do like stats. Make it more RPG-ish, and. Then Add more zombies, just more level of creativity, a better story, and you got a, a pretty good game, I think, if you add all of those. But I think this game achieved what it was supposed to achieve, and that is show off the Wii U's uh, capabilities, and it did that very well. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to how like other games use. The gamepad and stuff like that. The inventory uh, stuff was good. Like looking down, it was. They did a lot of things well with this game, but overall, I think there's a lot to improve with. I definitely did enjoy it, though. I mean, it was frustrating at times, but it still was fun. Uh, you get good scares, like I said. I've been got scared a whole bunch. Uh. I'm pretty sure other people have. It's a good zombie survival game, and it's probably one of the more scarier games I've played in a while. It really reminds me of the first Resident Evils and stuff like that. I'm not saying this is going to become Resident Evil, because it's not going to. But it has the potential to be a very good, uh, or a good series, I would say. But if I had to give a, a review or a score out of 10, I'd give it an 8. I mean, I was going to give it like an 8.25, but the ending was just weird. So I'd give it an 8 out of 10. So a good game. Uh, if you're looking for a game for the Wii U, this is probably not a bad choice. Um, so yeah, I mean, it was a scary game. I thought the gameplay was actually fun at times, but... They definitely need to add to it. Just adding to it will make a better sequel if we do make one. And a better story. And you got a pretty good sequel. But it does do what it's supposed to do, which is show off the gamepad's abilities, and it does it pretty well. So, yeah, like I said, fun game. Uh, I haven't tried multiplayer out yet, so I may have to do that. I don't know if I'll come back to this game uh, later on. Like, it's one of those games you play through once and you're like, oh, that's that's okay, and then you move on. But yeah, so 
I've been reflexing. Let me check the. See if there's not more. Let's skip the credits. That was just a weird. It just happened. Like all of a sudden. Unless there's something afterwards, which I not wouldn't be surprised of. And I don't know if I don't know if there is multiple endings or not. So maybe somebody in the comments below could let me know. I find I heard they say there is. Aha. Okay. We're not done exactly yet. Come on, look lively. We've got to get out of London now. I made a promise to a survivor that I'd be back. I don't know if that's you, but you're on the same frequency, so hurry to the tower. We'll wait as long as we can. Now run! I'm guessing if I die here, then uh, that's where it'll end. <laughs> So if I do die here, I will end the LP, just because that was supposed to be the ending. Get moving, there's no time to waste. We're on our way. Okay, let's kill this guy. <laughs> Well, no, I don't fall down. No! Ah, stupid water. A flare. Well, I can use anything at the moment. Planks aren't going to help me at all from here on out. There's another zombie something. Yeah. There is. One on the ground who keeps killing me. Oh gosh, I'm not gonna make it. Not gonna make it. Nope. God, fucking A. So stupid. I get stuck on a zombie. Alright guys, so that was the bad ending because I got completely screwed out of my stuff. But what are you going to do? So, I, yeah, I can't go back to that. I can only, uh... Alright, that's it, guys. Sorry you didn't get the good ending, but I got stuck with stuff in it. I couldn't do anything about it. Kind of a disappointing end, I'd say. Well, this game was a good game, so if you guys want to check it out, feel free. But uh, I've been really, you guys have been watching Zombie U. I'm just disappointed because I got the bad ending now. Because I, I feel like I should have beaten the game. But it just feels like I didn't. But anyways, yeah, I've been, I've been really, you guys are watching Zombie U. I want to thank you guys for watching. And, uh, not a bad let's play, guys. It's probably been what my most viewed so far. So, thanks for watching. I know there's been a lot of annoying parts. Uh, hopefully, you guys could enjoy it for what it is. And, like I said, uh, I'll see you guys around for another let's play. Probably, uh, Dead Space 3. So, uh, see you guys later.